Hey caregivers, it's your girl Melanie. I got advice for you. Hello wonderful caregivers, it's Melanie from Around the Way Training Consultants coming to you with more child care advice. Okay, so today we had a gentleman write in um, asking me was he being discriminated against or not. He works in a room where children are wearing diapers and he was told because he was a male and it makes the owners or possibly even parents uncomfortable that uh, that he cannot change diapers that is definitely discrimination if he was hired for a position hired in that room he needs to be allowed to fulfill whatever his job obligations are okay um and i'm saying this because that's the eeoc discriminate discrimination complaint that he could officially file if he chose to so just be mindful if you hired him for that position especially saying the owners are uncomfortable it's one thing if the parent is saying they're uncomfortable however you have to let the parents know that they cannot uh they you you greatly understand their concern however they cannot request for you to discriminate against your employee okay if he's in the room he needs to be allowed to fulfill that duty there are several men who change their children's diapers and it's not an issue okay furthermore there are women that sexually abuse children as well now if he's not in a room alone if there's another caregiver in the room I don't understand why there's a, why there would be an issue with him changing the diaper of a child. Furthermore, even if he was the only one in the room, it would not be fair um, for that child to have to sit in a soiled diaper until you can find a woman to come change the diaper for you um, or for the baby. Uh, I definitely feel like that's exactly why cameras are a good idea because you should trust him until he gives you a reason that he shouldn't be trusted and once he gives you a reason that he shouldn't you shouldn't trust him you need to contact everybody the authorities licensing all of that but if he hasn't given you a reason not to trust him you can't automatically just discriminate against him um eeoc says we can't discriminate against age sex religion sexual orientation culture none of those things disabilities we cannot do that we cannot do that and you definitely want to steer clear of putting yourself in legal action as an owner or as a director so if he's been hired in that specific room you need to allow him to fulfill his duties once again women sexually abuse children too okay not just me and for the owner to say that it makes them uncomfortable is really you know unfortunate because they need to become more aware of the legal ramifications of the things that they're saying okay um i definitely hope this was helpful to you guys if you have any concerns you can always reach out to me um at around the way training consultants you can send me a message on facebook okay uh i hope this was helpful for you thank you for joining us today and have a great day